I think I'm gonna start every episode with me like getting my camera out of the car. What's up? Oh, big golf, huh? All right. Got it. That was, did you see, could you see how nervous I was on my face? Got the quarters. Here we go. One, two, eight. Okay, can you see that? Here we go. Hey! I did it, don't worry about it. I got it. That's a cop, I'm sorry. Sorry about that. All right, man. Oh, man. Wow, that feels really tall. So we're gonna get down to the brass tacks here. If you're starting a channel, it's always good to figure out what kind of channel you wanna make it. And I, the way I boiled it down, boiled, boiled it down, like I got a cauldron full of carrots. I haven't had a good hot bed in a long time. Oh, first off, hey guys, before I just jumped right in there. Like a jump to conclusions, Matt. Jump to conclusions, Matt. Am I right, guys? My name's Tyler, thank you for joining Hitting 100K. We haven't made it yet. Um, we are still in the process, but I'm at the car wash. See that? Working at the car wash, yeah. See that little guy? You see that little guy? I wouldn't worry about that little guy. It's been about a year and a half that I've had this car and I've never washed it. Yeah. You're thinking, that's gross, Tyler. Probably. It's a little dirty. Dirty pop. Hey, what's up, Prius? <laughs> Dragon Ball Z shirt. Hope you guys like it. At least I'll make them work for it. Uh, it's a very narrow market, but here we are. Let's talk channels, shall we? If we're looking at, if you're looking at your, your YouTube channel, and there's two ways. And the best way I found to break this down, break it on down to Chinatown, the most channels are comprised are they're either a show or they're a network. The best way to think of this is your YouTube channel can either look like The Office or it can be NBC. If you tune in The Office, you know what you're gonna get. You know the characters, you know the show, you know the storyline, you know the plot. They don't have to set you up. They don't have to set you up every single time you are going in to watch it. It's not like I tune into The Office and guess what? They're hiking the you know, Alaskan mountain. It's not an Alaskan mountain, that was a terrible. You know, you're not gonna tune in and it's gonna be like a buddy cop drama. Like you know what you're getting in for. You're gonna watch off. Whereas with NBC, there are a bunch of shows. You could turn into NBC, one channel, that's two or 11. Mouth breather. One channel, you could tune into that and you could watch Jimmy Fallon, you could watch SNL, you could watch The Office, you could watch Parks and Rec, you could watch a t I only named comedies. <laughs> You could tune into any of those and you're in for a different experience. What I recommend, when you start your YouTube channel, you can look at it like, this is my show. Like, hey, here's my vlog. What's up, guys? What's up, everybody? Hey, little gang, what's happening? Hey, yo, good morning, little gang. So when you do that, when you have that vlog, that's your show. You, this is these characters doing sketches. Or you can set up your channel like a network. For instance, College Humor. College Humor has different series. Here's Jake and Amir. Oh, I never get it right when I guess that. I'm like, oh, for lifetime. Here, here's, I don't know, there's there's other ones that are on there. I've, I've toyed with both. Started out where I just dumped all my geometry videos. It's the exact same thing. What I started doing was I was trying to add in different elements, like a behind the scenes, or maybe I'll do some Google tutorials. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? This I started trying to bounce out different series. Now what I'm working on is laying it out to where I have essentially shows. So like, for instance, I started book club. Every Wednesday, someone could tune in and watch the show, like they're watching Friends on 7 o'clock on NBC. That's my show for Wednesdays. This is my show for Fridays, hitting 100K. So on Wednesdays, you know you're gonna get a Target Book Club. On Fridays, you know you're gonna get a Was. Oh, here we are again. And back at it again. Back at it again with the loud noise. And then Tuesdays, Tuesdays with Tyler. What up? Each day of the week, I'm trying to set up shows. Now, if you go in and look at my videos, you'll see big chunks of Google tutorial videos, and you're like, wow, there are no views on those. It's because I actually don't notify my subscribers. That's another episode on why I do that. Those are chunked in there, but after I get all those done, you would essentially be able to see these colors. So I've started trying to use different thumbnails, if you'll notice, and different colors for different thumbnails. So if someone went to my channel, they could see a show. Branding of that show would be that color trying to make it easier. If you're gonna be Casey Neistat who does a vlog, and that's the show, is Casey's vlog. The vlog's back. Then you don't really have to differentiate on your thumbnail. If you're gonna do something like I'm trying to do, you wanna differentiate, differentiate between the shows, and that way there's not confusion. When people tune in, they're like, why am I watching this guy on a car and a GoPro? Why am I watching this guy talk about YouTube? They know what they're in for. That's my thoughts. I'd love to know your thoughts. What do you prefer? The YouTube channels that you watch the most, are they more a channel? Like where there's a bunch of different stuff? Or is it like one one stream of con type of content? Let me know. Thanks for tuning in, guys. I gotta wash my car. My cat is dirty. Like, subscribe, do whatever people on the internet do. Pew, 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 pew.
See you later. <laughs>